Hey everyone, so I'm super excited to introduce you my new surface modeling course where you will learn how to create yeah, this pocket action cam completely from scratch with 100% surface modeling techniques. And honestly guys, this was for me the most fun course that I've created because the product is just absolutely amazing. And what you will learn is how to create really high quality surface transitions between different geometric forms and shapes like here for example, we have the circle, right? We have the rectangular shape and we have all that roundness around. And then we have beautiful patches and surfaces connecting all that. And if you see the zebra, everything is absolutely perfect and high quality. And even with this shading mode, and I know that most of you don't use the shading mode because it shows you every little mistake, like in a very ampl amplified way. And you see everything is 99% yeah, perfect and you have beautiful surface transitions between rounded surfaces, different geometric forms and shapes. And also if we go to the bottom, you see that we have G2 corners. So this is something what yeah, I would say Apple invented in industrial design. And if you have uh, some Apple AirPods at home, maybe you can just check them out that it's not just the box with some fillets applied. So you can try that out in plasticity, but you will obviously not get close that result, but you have have flat surfaces but you don't so if you have them at home you can see that you don't see where the curvature starts where the fillet starts because it's just one continuous perfect beautiful surface transition and curvature and this is also exactly what yeah dgi have done and what i have done in the course so you can learn that too and also you see again absolutely perfectly connected zebra stripes and it's just pure aesthetic it's beautiful techniques and you just see that even though that we have here at the bottom a flat surface, you don't see where the fillet starts and where it ends. It's just everything interconnected. So yeah, it was so much fun to work on that. And also guys, I know that a lot of you struggle with breaking down complex forms and shapes into smaller pieces and faces and how to set up the right patch. Because as you see, again, we have here a curved face. We have here a rectangular flat shape. We have here on the left side a, a face which is a little bit curved as you see. So we will literally recreate this pocket three thing one to one exact. And also here curved a shape and then we have here the circular shape and then we have to connect all that, right? And then you will end up with the hole here, right? So we will set up everything perfectly. So you can then use here, select all of those edges and just patch it so you don't need even X nerves. And bam, you can give everywhere G1 and here even G2. And voila, guys, look what a absolute beautiful patch and surface transition we have. And that whole model, model has like dozens of them. And also here a chamfer, which is absolutely beautifully ending into this circular shape. And yeah, so also here at the top, you might think, oh, this piece is boring. I can do that with booleans. No, you can't because also here you see you have one flat surface splitting into two connected with this beautiful fillet here, which is also perfectly transitioning into the flat surface. And you have everywhere all this kind of surface modeling. And this is also why I love to recreate, in my opinion, the best products in the world. So from Apple and DJI and from some other big companies, because you just learn how to do it the right way if you just recreate and you just learn from the best. And I don't know what about you, but I personally, in every area of my life, I try to learn from the best or to recreate what the best are doing to understand it in the first place and then apply those learnings and teachings which you can do also then after watching the course to your own projects and to your own knowledge and implement it in your own workflow and creativity right so yeah this is exactly what this course is for and also just one thing maybe you you don't know who i am you see this video the first time so i'm nikita and yeah, i'm a passionate 3d modeler and a teacher and I have over 100 plasticity tutorials on my YouTube channel as well as over 15 paid premium 
plasticity courses and just through that I just learned what exactly really helps you in the most efficient and fastest way so you get the best results. So in the course there is no second which is wasted. You just get a completely step-by-step -step streamlined process with the best techniques and I will always explain to you exactly what I'm doing, why we are doing that and which is important to have an, an eye on. Yeah so if that's something you're interested in and you truly want to master surface modeling check out first link below this video you will find my product page here you will find some additional details check them out and then very important at the bottom you can choose between two options if you want so this course this pocket cam course is for those who have already a little bit of experience in surface modeling so maybe you watched already two or three tutorials of mine or you took some surface modeling course of mine then you can directly jump right into that but if you are very new to surface modeling and you're just don't understand what is tangency, G2, G1, patches, lofts, how to create high quality patches, how to set up the right faces, edges and curves, then I can absolutely recommend you the Action Cam Starter Bundle, which will include the Action Cam course and this Helmet Surface Modeling course. You can scroll down a little bit and you can click here and then you can also check out what this course is about. And this is the perfect introduction in my opinion for surface modeling. You will learn how to create this helmet as an absolute beginner completely from scratch in just in a few hours. And how is that possible, you might ask. It's because I have included a huge bonus course, a full introduction into surface modeling. What is tangency? Curvature, G0, G1, G2, how to set up basic lofts and patches. And you will really understand the absolute core fundamentals and basics that you just need for surface modeling and which will enable you to recreate almost any product. So yeah, again, everything is explained on the product page. First link below this video. I hope I can see you in there. Have a nice day. Happy modeling. Bye.